Hello Maplers, my name is Jonax and welcome back to my Serial 4 class domain. Today we will be featuring Kaiser. Kaiser is the Dragon Warrior, Protector of Pantheon or how you want to name it. And it's a warrior which uses strength as main stat, secondary stat is dex. It's uh, quite strong. It does require a lot of funding to make it really strong. But it's a really strong GPS plus. Its linked skill is um, 10, 15 or 20% HP. Which depends of course on the level of your link. So level 70, level 120 or level 210. Its card is 10, 20, 40, 80 strength. Depending on your level of course again. Okay then let's show you the skills of... Kaiser. We have exclusive spell, which is pretty much echo for any other shard. Then we have the vertical grapple. This skill is uh, all the jobs are getting it with the cooldown in fifth job. It just moves you around uh, a map vertically really quickly. Transfiguration is a passive uh, attack speed burst. And it will help fill up your morph cards, which is this one. And when you fill up your morph cards, you can transform into Kaiser's ultimate final form. However, um, if you use skills, you fill it up. But if you use Dragon Link skills, which it will fill up faster, and Dragon Link will also make it possible for you to. Uh, attack faster. So Dragon Slash is your standard normal attack skill. Replace your normal attack and you get enhanced every job. Flame Switch is not such a good rate skill. You barely use it. LFT is your double jump. And Skill Skin is your passive skill for some stunts. So Dragon Slash gets enhanced here, so a bit more damage. Peace and Blaze is a rush skill, so you can knock back some enemies with it. Like that. Then you have Tempest Blades, which will show you a couple of or five swords above your head. And you can cast this as well, and then the swords fly all the way to the closest mobs and do a decent amount of damage. And then you can summon them above your head again, and they will look like the two handed sword you're wearing. So, one place one is a buff, mastery, and the other is our passives. Kaiser is a two handed sword. Wing Beat is really good if you want to do optimal damage. Um, what you want to do is you have your 4 job skill Giga Slash and Wing Beat. You want to spam pretty much Giga Slash and then have continuously 2 Wing Beats if possible on the map. They do 40 quick attacks. This is the most efficient for bossing. But for mobbing it works as well. And pressure chain. With this skill you can pull monsters towards you. And do damage of course. Either they die or they get pulled to you. And in the third job you get your first final form part. And stone dragon which is your summon skill. So for one minute you can summon it and also it attracts mobs towards it, so it gets on echo. Curse it is a buff and also boosts your final form damage. Catalyze is another strong buff. And we have self recovery which Use your HP and MP with 5% every 4 seconds. 
and we get some extra strength, base strength and HP. Then we have enhanced Dragon Slash in the Forge Up again. And you see below it already Giga's Wave. That is a really fast attacking passing skill. It only hits one mobs, however when you in final form it will hit three mobs. And you want to combine this one with Wing Beat for optimal DPS on bosses. It's a very fast hitting attack skill. Then we have Dragon Birds, which is your main mopping skill, and it's close AI around you, it will pretty much kill all the mobs. You have to be quite close to the mobs to kill them with it, but for the rest, it's an efficient uh, mopping skill. And we have Play Burst. Which charges you pretty much to the enemies. And then we have Inferno Bread. It is an uh, attack with some cooldown and uh, does high damage and after it at least a uh, flame dot on the ground. And then we have advanced tempo space, pretty much the same skill as previous, just some more damage to it. Grand Armor gives you some damage reduction, doesn't do any reduction against fixed damage skills, so that's too bad. You can share it with the party though. And then we have Unbreakable Will, Ignoring Defense and Mastery. Another standard skills, Nova Warrior is your Maple Warrior skill, and Nova Temperance is your Hero's Will. And then we have Defender. Mode and attack mode, which get enhanced every job. And pretty much that's a toggle. You can be either in attacker mode or in defender mode. Defender mode gives some more defense and HP, attacker mode gives more boss damage, attack buffs. And Christians. Then we have the hyper skills, Kaisa Majesty. Um, it has a few important effects. It improves your attack speed. Uh, you can ignore enemies' the damage reflect. So really good for Hela and stuff. And you can um, reset cooldowns of skills, including. Uh, your Echo, which is exclusive spell for Kaiser. You can only um, reset the cooldown of Kaiser own skills, not of guild skills or other special skills. Uh, final trans brings you immediately in the final form. Or if your mouth is filled up, your wing beats are a lot bigger and you hit Lines with Giga Wave, the Tempest Blades are a lot bigger as well. The hitbox is also bigger, and your other hyper is a big yellow flash. You couldn't see it here properly, but it uh, hits a lot of mobs uh, around you on the map. And it's not really a nice skill to be next to as a party member.
So this is a bit how Kaiser looks like if you are in transform mode. Let's show you some uh, lower level job skills. Also with the morphing ghost what you can do, you can assign uh, three skills to your Kaiser link skill or Kaiser link mode. And then with the command keys, you use them to attack faster and fill up your morph codes faster. I would prefer to have um, play burst to your mopping skill and giga wave and wing beat on them. And it's up to you which one you want to have. You can just drag them on it and then it will put it on. As I said before, with Kaiser Magici, Kaiser's hyper skill, you can ignore damage reflect, but also weapon or magic debuff when you hit one on one. So let's wait till Hilla does the R and then we can then we can show you how it works. Meanwhile I would like to say thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And I hope to see you all in the next video again with the next uh, job showcase. Let me know which job you would like to see next. And there's one thing I didn't mention about um, Kaiser's Transform yet. You can have different colors in each transform. I have um, the black color one and my guildie as well. But you can have very ugly colors or green, blue, pink. Let me know which Kaiser color you picked. And there is the R. So, time to show Kaiser Meyer's teeth and do full damage while well. Hila is on the R. Doesn't matter which skill. So, thank you all for watching and I hope to see you in the next one. Goodbye.